have no, there haven't been any reported sightings of the snake in quite a while. And so police are urging people not to let that stop them from coming down here to Riverbank Park, where the Westbrook City Band will be entertaining people beginning tonight at 6 o'clock, the kickoff to the free summer concert series. And, you know, if you've been living under a rock or are just unfamiliar with the now legendary Wessie story, the snake was initially reported as being the length of a truck with a head the size of a soccer ball. I know it sounds like something straight out of the jungle book. The shock and awe of that started drawing people to the park, each one hoping to catch a glimpse. And the next time the snake was spotted was last week in the middle of the night by two Westbrook police officers who saw it reportedly eating a beaver. Westbrook police say they are continuing to keep an eye out. We've had officers checking all three shifts, our animal control officers out there multiple times daily, and the main warning service has checked it all. There's been no further sightings reported by police or the public. And I know David mentioned it last week. There's been a parody Twitter account set up at Wessiethons. Uh, I thought I'd send it a message today and say, uh, hey, Snake, what you up to on this nice day? It replied that it was tanning on the top of Time and Temp, a little jab at our old studios there in Portland. But back here at Riverbank Park in Westbrook, no need to worry. Just be aware of your surroundings, police say. And the Westbrook City Band is going to be kicking things off at 6 o'clock. A barbecue begins at 5. We're live in Westbrook. I'm Katie Thompson, WMTW News 8.